here we are at the next adventure. Let's head in. Halloween, oh look at that. Oh, that's cool. Might be able to clean that up. Seven dollars on that. As always, thanks for joining us today. Be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. Please leave a comment. Let us know what you thought of today's video. As always, we'll put a recap time on the screen for you so you can Skip to see the goods that we got at the end if you would like. Why you got a witch's hat on? Help me look for this. Is it fake?
Jacuzzi tunes will probably just like that for some reason. Throw it in there. Yep. I was just flinging a poo at you. Not the bin we were looking for. But I guess we'll pick through it at this point. Hopefully Lucy Tunes gets a better one. Maybe there'll be a treasure beneath here, but I doubt it. Probably should move. Looks like Lucy Tunes didn't get a very good one either. Boo! crate for eight dollars that doesn't seem too bad worth considering maybe What's that? that yeah, this one has a hole in it though. Yeah. I mean, this one looks nice. Yeah. I'd say that's a good find. I would, I would think it's the same $2. I love that chair. Yeah. Have you ever got anything good on it? Um, I mean, what, what do you consider good? Like a fight? <laughs> No, I have. You get it for the fines. You get it for like what you find. We get it for the fines, but we also do like geocaching. I mean, we ran into like a homeless camp in the middle of a woods. That was kind of that was interesting. So, and I mean, as far as the fines here go, we found a couple hundred dollar items, but nothing too incredible yet. No we're Not yet. We're still kind of new. Yeah, we. There was a fight here two weeks ago. Oh, really? Somebody grabbed a skillet, and this lady's finger got caught in it, and he pulled it out of her hand. This is a freaking temperature gauge. Measures the temperature and just sits on your desk. That's really cool. You can see it's sinking at 78 degrees in here. I'm gonna pick this up. That's really cool. Someone will love that. It's time for the recap. 
Welcome to the recap, guys. As you saw, one of the first things we got was this pretty awesome Batman mask that does have some voice changing feature for the microphone. And we love it, we're keeping it. This we will probably be using in our live streams. So stay tuned for that. This is a Hello Kitty karaoke machine and it does work. It does not have the microphone, unfortunately, but I still think we will be able to sell this decent amount. We did grab a few pairs of shoes. These are Keens. I do believe they are waterproof hiking shoes and they are a US size eight. And they're in pretty good condition. New Balance men's shoes that were brand new with tags. Size 11 and a half. Women's Nike Air Max. These are size seven and a half. And these are in really good condition. Was actually pretty thrilled to find these. Next up, we've got a Cutter and Buck green canvas tote bag. Next, we've got the Walt Disney World Railroad train set. So you can see that. It is very dirty. Bricko snow helmet. Next up, we have the Agora soccer referee flags. Voldemort found one and I found one. We are going to sell these together in a bundle. An American Girl Bitty Baby. It was one of the first things we grabbed at the bins. I think we'll do well on this. The desktop temperature gauge. So one of my more interesting finds of the day was an iPhone 4 <laughs> that had all the, the all these cases. I did not find the cord. I can still sell it for parts. Um, so I think it is still a win. And I could take it to one of those little phone recycling kiosk things that they have everywhere now. We've got a Pocket Pain Pro here. And it is pretty much brand new in the box. Um, I think this one will do well as well. Another Voldemorty find was these awesome little green men. There's like nine or 10 of these in here. We're gonna sell them as a bundle. We got this guy, this one. Vivitar scope, a small atta scope attachment. There's two of these in this box. We've got a Disney Pirates of the Caribbean at World's End wallet. And we do always check purses, wallets, pants, anywhere money would be kept because people do find money at the bins. We'll show you this first because it is containing more items. But we do have the Harry Potter up to no good backpack. First off, We've got an Adidas soccer ball, size three. Just so happened to find the Simply Vera, Vera Wang pajama set. And it is really soft. It is a size small. The Roots USA 2002, I would assume Olympics bag. We did sell a Coles Cares Clifford, the big red dog plush. And I found this one and I instantly grabbed it because I know I can sell it. I'm constantly saying that I need to stop grabbing Beanie Babies, but this is one of those grail ones that everyone's looking, always looking for. So I figured this would be my last attempt. It does have the hang tag and everything. So if you want gobbles, I have him and he's gorgeous. Animal Adventure Tyrannosaurus Rex plush. An Animal Kingdom Disney Dino-Rama plush. A Disney Mr. Smee McDonald's toy. I think someone will buy it. We also have the Samsung Blu-ray home theater system thing with the remote. Is anybody out there a Michigan State fan? We will just be bundling this with one of our Michigan State items. And the final item that I found was a 100% cashmere scarf. And I'm gonna sell this for like 40 bucks. 
So there you have it, henchmen. That's your recap. If you'd like to know what any of these items might have sold for, keep an eye out on our What Sold with Lucy Tunes videos. That is where you will find out what they were priced for, if we got offers, and what the final sale price was. And we will catch you in the next adventure. Bye, guys.